This being a Baptist church, we are having a baptism this morning. Uh, in our tradition, what that means is that Ethan is taking a step of obedience. He has already professed his faith in Jesus Christ, and now he comes to let the world know that Jesus Christ is his Lord. It uh, is the uh, ancient Near East uh, New Testament uh, equivalent of taking out an ad in the local newspaper uh, saying, I'm Ethan Clements, I am living for Jesus Christ. If you see me behaving in any way differently than I should, please let me know. Uh, but it means much more than that. The reason why we immerse people in water and dunk them all the way down is because in Galatians it tells us that going down into the water signifies identifying with Jesus Christ's death, and then when we come out of the water, uh, it signifies our agreement with the resurrection. And that is why um, Baptists uh, immerse. Ethan, would you come and join me? You can face that way for All a minute. Right. This is Ethan Clements, uh, and uh, an outstanding young man. And uh, he has asked us to uh, baptize him this morning. I have a couple questions for you this morning, Ethan. One is, do you believe that Jesus Christ died for your sins? Yes. Have you accepted Jesus Christ as your savior? Yes. That hand, you wanna grab your nose. Then by the authority of Jesus Christ, I baptize you in the name of the Father, and the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Let's pray. Father, we want to pray that uh, we would all encourage Ethan in his walk with the Lord. We know that he has begun by faith, but we also continue by producing obedience from that faith. And Lord, we ask that today he would continue to uh, be obedient to you. Lord, we thank you for his testimony. We thank you for the love that he has for you. And Lord, we pray that we would all encourage Ethan in the days ahead. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Steve?